Hello guys and welcome to a new brand video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix iTunes 3194 error. So basically, those are some fixes that you can try to solve this problem. So the first thing that you will need to consider is to update your iTunes to the latest version. To do so, you will need just to go to your iTunes, go to the help and then search for this check for updates uh, choice and then you will need just to confirm and you will need just to update your items otherwise you will need to check if there is anything that is uh, standing between your connection and your apple servers connection so basically you will need just to check if there is any ip filtering like a vpn or in uh, any other softwares like firewalls or firewalls so basically you will need just to disable all the, your network securities for uh, to check the cause of this problem so basically if you have any of those softwares you will need just to stop them and uh, quit them so you can solve this problem otherwise it can be just some hosts problem so basically you will need just to look up for this entry in uh, these hosts files so basically we need just to go to our uh, computer or any file explorer and then you will need just to go to your local desk C and then we will need just to search for Windows with double click and then searching for the system 32 file or folder and now we are just going to search for the etc folder so just go here to the searching bar and search for etc and then we will find this folder we click on it and basically now we want to uh, have these host files we want to uh, open it and basically we need just to click on the notepad to open it or use any other text uh, reader uh, softwares we click on ok and then we need just to look up for this entry so basically you need just to check for this entry and just look in uh, for it and if you don't not find it you will need just to add it so basically only i'm just going to copy and paste it here you will have it like that and then you will need just to save the file otherwise if you can find it and it is already located in your uh, file you will need just to add this symbol to it so that itunes can recreate this entry and it will re uh, refresh the connection between your computer and the apple servers and otherwise you can try again for these other entries if this one doesn't work so basically now you will need just to save the file and then you will need just to quit force quit you can just go to the task manager for example and then go to your itunes and then end task so you can quit it and restart it after saving the notepad so basically this is how you can do it Thank you for watching and see you next time.